Hey folks, this is Vagrant and welcome back to Dredge. In the last video we got started for the first time, we got our little shippy shippy. And uh, we've done some basic upgrades. We've got to sell some lights, we've got to sell some crab pots, which we need to fix actually. We've got a couple of fishing poles and we did pick up a new engine as well. Now we've been told about a couple different... Uh, a couple of different shipwrecks lying around, Greater Marrow and Little Marrow, and I think that's what we're going to start with exploring today. Remember, we need some cash so we can get ourselves our new oceanic uh, real thing in particular. But first, let's go ahead and shipwright, get those fixed. Um, I'm trying to consider whether I want to buy more crab pots. And I'm, I'm gonna go with no for now. Let's let's head out. Let's head out and let's swap to our crab pots like so. I wonder if deeper is good somehow. I don't know. Blonk. And we'll throw one a little bit further away this time. Three point one meters. I suspect the deeper it is, it just means like you get different crabs, right? Uh, so where are we gonna go? Let's go for the greater marrow one. Wait, no. Which is the? Let's go for the little marrow one. I want to... Mm, yeah, we go a little marrow. I'm not going to get any fish on the way. I want to make sure we get there as early as possible. I figure because time only passes in this game when you move or when you fish and stuff like that. So if you prioritize... Prioritization is good, is what I'm trying to say. However, I'm not going to pass up on this. Because I love my dredging. Who knows what wonders await in the deep? Metal scraps for the very first time. Very cool. So we brave those stormy seas. I need to watch like a... <laughs> oh, sweet. Take up so much room, though. I need to watch like some fishing related... What's going on this? This is flashy. I wonder if that means there's an aberrant in here. I think it might do. Oh. Oh, that is what it means. Good to know. Okay, that'll do for now. We got ourselves a, a humongous riddled flounder. An absolute gigantic one. Jesus. Okay, no more fishing. <laughs> I need to make sure that I can fish up whatever it is we're aiming for around the back of this island. This is a little nerve-wracking. I thought we could kind of get there and get back nice and quick, but um, we are going to be sailing in the darkness, to say the least. To say the least, it is miles away. The stone hums quietly, sending ripples through the air around it. Faint shapes stance upon its surface, vanishing before your eyes can focus. Let's touch it! The cold stone does not respond to your touch. Interesting. Encyclopedia. Riddled flounder. Baggy skin perforated with countless cavities. A singular shapeless mass spreads underneath. Very cool, very sexy. Right, let's go. This is why we need a better engine, so I can actually go on little adventures like this and not feel like I'm gonna die. So what do we have here? Oh, it is a shipwreck, isn't it? Oh, 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 it's speedy. It's speedy. I'll give it that. Jesus Christ. Oh, that was close. All right, I got a gigantic key. I guess I'm gonna have to throw away the flounder. Yeah, there's, there's really no alternative, is there? Okay, that's cool. That, what is that? Ornate key. Now that... What did, what, what, what did that guy want? What did he want? Relics. Ah, it is... Okay, cool. Uh, I trying to decide what's the quickest way home. It's probably this way, actually. I think, I think this would have been slightly faster. Let's get the lights on. And let's just get the hell back to town. There it is. There. Follow the lights, baby. Follow the lights. I just want to get through that little ridge. You can see that little break in the rock in front of me. That's what I want to get through before the um, the fog completely smothers me. Mm, come on, little buddy. I need, I need my boat. I just thought about that. Oh, there's another aberration. I don't have... Oh, but I want it. I want it. I want it. Screw it. Oh, it's just a black grouper. See you later, buddy. Oh, it's still there, that's why. There we go, Vul... Oh, and we'll... 
voltaic group are very cool. Okay, hello. Yes, my buddy. Right, we're nearly there, we're nearly there. I wonder if aberrations are like more common at night time or something, because we did just see two of them. <sighs> Spooksville indeed. But hey, two new aberrant fish, very cool. I'm gonna throw that into storage. I could really do with some more inventory space. It's becoming problematic. Uh, encyclopedia. An unknown green energy arcs and crackles over this fish's scales. It thrashes ceaselessly even hours after being pulled from the water. All right, let's talk to the fishmonger. Have you got any of the mutants with you now? Remember any aberrant will suffice? I suspect they're all the same. Uh, well, this one's my big boy, right? I feel that was probably worth more, so I'm gonna sell- I'm gonna give him the Voltaic. The fishmonger takes the aberrated fish from you. He clutches it close to his chest, wringing his hands around its slimy body. Oh. $140? What? And two research parts? Ah, oh, Amazing. Mm, do you hear that? It sounds like the faintest whispering. You listen. Silence. In the stillness of the room, the fishmonger's hands begin to tremble. His face grows anguished. Please, sell what you need, then leave. I must deal with this creature. Quickly now! It's actually worth less. Interesting. Oh, excuse me. Ugh. You hear the heavy scraping of metal bar sliding across it. Wow, he's probably out for the day. Um, right, research. So we can get Volca. I haven't seen Mangrove or Coastal, so it doesn't make sense to get those right now, right? I think... Okay, well, these all cost one. So we should upgrade the engine. Let's upgrade the engine. Well, unlock a better engine. Fifteen, nine, but you can see it's only, um... It's only, it only takes up one slot. Look at that beast. Uh, that's 25, but it's huge. So that isn't really any better than that. That's 35. I don't really see the point in that one. It's probably cheaper, but still. Uh, let's have a look at pots. Improved design, this crab pot should be more effective at cra craft... craft blah, blah, blah. So that goes in the water for longer, which I don't think is necessarily good. Because they max out anyway, right? They fill up. That one's a larger space. I think that's the one I want more. Does that just mean that's got a higher yield? Yeah. Let's go that one. Okay. And dry dock. I want what I want more than anything else is a veterinary space. <sighs> Do I need to get all the upgrades before I can get that? It takes a lot of materials either way. Um Maybe I should start working on these. I'll tell you what, let's buy the other thing we wanted first, which was... Well, I want I want that reel, right? And we can sell this. And we can sell this. So we've gained room anyway, so now we can cut fish in coastal and in shallow. Quicker as well. So that's sweet. Uh, so yeah, can I move these away? No. Hey, get off, get off. To storage. Refund. What? Did I buy that accidentally? <laughs> I think I did, yes. <laughs> um, so I'm not crazy, right? That, that's everything I need. Yeah. So I do want the hydraulic rod. That's 410. Let's have a look what else we can get. I think I want to upgrade... 14. I wouldn't mind upgrading the engine as well. Which means a 15 rather than a 10. That's going to cost me... Oh, I nearly got enough. But also, we need new... Cra Where do you get crab pots from? Oh, from the fishmonger. Okay. I'm going to rest. Away! Evast me hearties! Let's go check our crab pots. I am speed. Okay, you're not ready yet. I'll leave you for a little bit longer. How you doing, bucko? 
Uh, okay, I can I can see the benefit of improved yield as well. I'm just gonna do some basic fish catching along the way because we 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 can do with some cash, generally speaking. Let's just actually get some money in. <laughs> got a crazy thought. All right, like I said, I'll leave them when they get to low. And I really want to try to avoid. Uh, I guess Mac will do fit nicely into the gaps. That's something. I love my cod. Love Britain, love cod. Simple as that. <laughs> oh, I didn't want to deplete it. Oh, an all seeing cod. Look at that monster. Staring outwards, unblinking, eyes borrowed from a larger borrowed from a larger being, but not the mind to process what it sees. So that cod is tripping balls right now. <laughs> Very cool. Right, well, let's um We'll go turn this key in. I think we'll go do the little marrow one. Eh, I mean, we've probably got time. Let's let's see how we're doing. Let's see how we're doing. I'm a little sniffly this morning. Please forgive me. Oh, I think I've just got allergies. I started spending a lot more time outside now that it's you know it's warming up and it's getting sunnier. I've started taking some allergy medication. It's just um, I only just took it, so it's not kicked in yet. Trader. Wait, no, this isn't where I'm meant to be. We're going to over there, aren't we? Yeah, that might be a bit too much of a trek. I think I'm going to focus on this, on dredging for uh, materials, so we can do some big... Then again, we don't have the cash to do it, so we do need to do both. Dredge, 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 dredge. God damn it. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> this is why we need to dredge, though, because we need materials to upgrade things so we can actually carry more stuff, you know? Oh, very close. I think it's... Um, what if the key... Well, we're about to clear some room because of the key. Okay, right. I've got, I've got a bit of a plan in mind. Let's see what happens with this key first. You enter the collector's house, he's standing at the back of the room, still holding the silver and crimson book. He seems impatient. Well, you have something, don't you? Show me. Now, I recorded the last video last night, so I don't remember what voice I did. <laughs> you hand him the key. Wait, no. You hand him the key. The cold metal shimmers a strange shine as he holds it. The shape of the key. The head. The teeth. Now somehow seem... Bad combination. Now somehow seem changed. Smaller. Has it always been this way? Is this all? Where is the lock? The collector grows agitated, it seems. The pieces we're looking for have travelled farther than I anticipated. Much further, I suspect. In that case, allow me to age your travels. <laughs> he turns a few pages in his book and mutters something low under his breath. I feel he probably isn't that dramatic. I feel like he's probably very low-key. Whoa! A burst of light fills your vision. You stagger back briefly. Now go, we have more re I've got haste! My intuition tells me that the current may have carried some debris to the southeast towards Gale Cliffs. Mark location. Okay. Anything else? No, that's it. Cheers. Oh. Right. The book holds power from the deep. I merely extended its powers towards you. It's the one in particular you wish to know about. Haste. The words of haste are instant and cruel. They will impart a terrible speed to your vessel. Be warned, however, it may put a great deal of stress on your engines. Oh. That's like some eldritch powers going on. I don't know if we should be trusting this collector guy. Quite some time. I used to be a fisherman, as was my father before, but two decades ago I took up residence here. I need to focus on other endeavours. I found that this island has a certain strength to it, those dark basalt columns stretching downwards into the deep. Do you know who owned these relics? Yes. Who? <laughs> he looks at you. For a moment a look at something like regret flashes in his eyes. An old friend. Where should I look for relics? My intuition tells me that the current may have carried them to southeast towards Gale. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so I guess that's the next. That's that's the game kind of suggesting, hey, this is the next place you should go to. You know what I mean? Because there's like four locations, and it's saying, yeah, you know, maybe this is the next spot. And there's two, three more rest spots there, so that's cool. We're gonna rest for the night though. And then we're gonna. I just want to make sure we've done this area completely. I think we should maybe get a couple of upgrades before we move on as well. Haste has speeds your engines, but increases panic and engine heat. I can see the benefit, if absolutely need be, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna be using that right now. I'm not sure I'll ever. I'm not totally sure I'll ever use it. If I'm totally honest. 
If it's otherworldly, that makes me very suspicious. I feel like the game isn't going to leave me alone unless I use it. There you go. Right. So what do we call our ship? SS... No. I need to, I need to, I need to look at what ships are called. Oh, what is this? Oh, there's dredges in it. Oh, there's two dredges. Very cool. Let's see what we've got here. Jesus Christ! <laughs> really making me... Oh, the belt buckle. Oh, sweet. Really making me put the freaking work in there. <laughs> it's mad. Ah, oh, so much calmer. So much more chill. So much nicer. <sighs> I'm a little proud of myself for not messing up once. Okay. I would like to do some more, but we should head back. Turn the belt buckle. So let's return the belt buckle and... Let's turn the belt buckle. Turn in our fish. Ooh. Let's see what we can do. I really do want to prioritize trying to upgrade the amount I can carry. This seems the most important to me. And we can also trade as well for that other thing. Shoop. Oh, that little noise it makes. Okay, let's trade it. Chain? Wasn't worth much. And the father. Hello, is everything okay? Give the belt buckle to the man. Yes. You give the belt buckle to the man. <laughs> this is. This is his. Oh, thank you. Bless you. You've returned him to me. Please, take this. Cool. Anything else I can help you with? No, that's it. Cheers, buddy. Chuka, 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 chuka. Uh, I was going to say we've got a bit of room, but we don't actually have any room whatsoever, so. Chuka, 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 chuka. I guess we get some... Can we get some mackerel? I can, I can fit I can fit two mackerel in. Let's, let's squeeze some, mackerel, some mackies in there. Why am I a, why am I a train? <laughs> Not a boat. Just an old man who loves the sea, you know. What's the boat? Wait, what's that? Well, I'm doing this. I'm gonna Google this. What is the boat called in? Uh, dangerous, perfect storm. Hit. 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 One sec. Uh, perfect Storm boat name. Andrea Gale. That's a rubbish name. <laughs> um, what's the name of the boat in Jaws? The Orca. That's cooler. That's better. I like that more. We are the Orca. The lighthouse keeper emerges from the dark forest that flanks the town. She walks towards the dock with a confused look on her face. Okay, and the justification is we used to be fishing in the Arctic. We were like, or like off the coast of Iceland and there's orcas, probably off the coast of Iceland, I guess. And a terrible accident occurred. So we called our boat the Orca to honor it, but a terrible accident occurred. And oh, our wife drowned and was eaten by seagulls. So we had to, so we left the area. And that's why we've come to this tiny little fishing village because we wanted to get away from the public and from the, the prying eyes and just be alone with our grief. It's a classic Lovecraftian eldritch setup. I need to be a grizzled detective, really. <laughs> oh, it's you. Are you expecting? Your engine, it sounds like, I'm sorry, I'm sick for the vessel of an old friend. Aw, like the old mayor. Dejected, she turns and walks back towards the lighthouse. Ugh, blinding headache today. Did you come by yesterday? I don't recall. Anyway, what can I do for you? Okay, so. Stealth. They're not worth much. Suddenly money seems harder to come by. Actually, the flounders suck. Mackerel's worth more. Wait. Oh, they're all... Wait, how are they all rotting already? That's why they're not worth anything. Hmm. I'm a little annoyed about it. Why are they... Wait, did I sleep? 
I guess I must have done. Um, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna save the points now. We need at least two for everything I want. I need cash, but I also need resources. Maybe it's worth waking up like a little. Hmm, that might be a good point. Maybe it's worth waking up like a little bit before the dawn. Uh. Ah. Oh. She pulls a book from her toolbox and hands it to you. Few of the pages are stuck together. Grease. Sexy, sexy grease. Um, I did say I wanted to upgrade my engine. I could afford it if I sold the old one. Let's do it. Got myself five more nuts. Very cool. Uh, we are now exceptionally poor. Which is fun. Remember, you don't have to have all the materials at once. You can store whatever you have right here at the dry dock. Wait, how do I... Right, it's, it's like putting them into the individual thing, isn't it? Yeah. So I guess that makes... Right, 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 right. What do we want? I wouldn't mind engine space. This is the one I mainly want, though. But, look, I can't, I can't click that. I suspect I need at least one of these, if not all of them. So what do I prioritize? I don't need more rods. I think I think maybe engine space, honestly. Although maybe I should go for the cheapest one first. So I need two wood. Wait, I can do that, I think. Isn't it? That, that, that. I don't have the money, but. I get it, I get it, love, I get it. Oh, <laughs> just, just did something very silly, one sec. We're getting there. I know! <laughs> Let me alone, please. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. So that's ready to go. We just need the cash. Oh, I should also put that into storage as well. Okay. Boop. Now, we don't have any grand thing to do today, do we? What is that? Oh, that's the woman who wants to set up the shop. Hmm, I think she needed loads of lumber and stuff. I think she needed stuff we probably don't have. Let's go check on our crappies. Oh, and our book. We got a new book. Correct engine operation. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I'm suddenly thinking that having more room for the crab pots isn't necessarily helpful and that I've picked the wrong one because these aren't filling up at all. I think maybe I looked out the first time, you know? I'll tell you what, let's grab this. Yeah, we'll, we'll grab... We'll just, let's just fill up on fish. As much as we can. It's helpful right near the thing anyway, so if I just... It's just eating money, isn't it? It's not going to delay me, but it doesn't really matter if I get delayed here. Whoa. Oh, I've got trophy fish. So maybe you need to... Um, the yellow ones always seem to be trophy ones. Maybe that's one of the things you need to do. Maybe you need to hit the yellow one in order to get a trophy fish. Anyways, that should be like a lot of quick, easy money. I don't know how you do it every day. These old bones wouldn't cut it on the high seas. Sell all for oh god, that was barely any money at all. That was rubbish. Rubbish. That, that genuinely was pretty rubbish. <laughs> Crowd pot. I might go... To, I want to just try stick this somewhere else. Just, just mix things up a little bit. Oh, well, not many crabs out here, though. Your oceanic. We can't do that yet, but soon. Oh, there we go. So we're just gonna grab what fish we can in this immediate area, sell, and then we'll we'll start doing something else tomorrow. Mackies. Mackies. There's a special Mackies in here. I see it. Mackies. Where's my special Mackies? 
Maybe it just means that it's got the potential for that. We'll come back. Or maybe it has to be night. I don't know. Whatever. Squiddies. Ooh, trophy squid. Now, it's going to hit night time. I'm aware of this. But we're, we're fairly near to the town. So I'm not terribly concerned about that. Just trying to make some cash. <laughs> okay. It is spooky at night, though. <laughs> Paranoia. I could grab a couple more fish. I don't see any reason why not. Seems perfectly safe. Ooh, more squid. I can get two more. Let's do it. I want to fill up entirely on squid. I'm just a big squiddy boy. Look at that. This has to be worth some money. And I got an achievement for perfect... Whoa, that little rock. <laughs> Proper snuck up on me. I got an achievement for my perfect packing. What have you got for me today? Squids. Many squids. Go. Uh, right. So, dry dock. Not, not, not dry dock. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Boop. Okay. I do feel like I probably need to get all of them, don't I? Uh, what else have I got material-wise? I've got cloth. Let's just get... It all out. I've got cloth and metal scraps, cause and we'll just put it into the dry dog. That's cloth. That's cloth. That's probably the one I'd want next to get more engine space. The problem is, you get more engine space and stuff like that. Then inherently, you also get less space. Well, no, you don't get less space for fish, but adding the engines obviously does. This one means we can hold nets instead of rods, though. So that one's just like a straight up upgrade. That's cool. Uh, right, I also want to buy another light, I think. Oh! Can I afford it if I sell that? 50. If I want a halogen spotlight? I mean, lumen wise, it's basically the same. No, it's, it's 300 more lumens. And it adds five on my range. Okay, let's do that. Yeah! Getting a little fancy up here. Getting a little fancy. Let's rest. Okay. And um, we'll just keep fishing in the air. Uh, hmm. Right, okay. Quite excited about that. Uh, where should we go? The crabs probably won't. Let's, let's, go try, let's go check this island out. To the north. We'll grab any interesting things along the way. Eels, for example. Ah! This one's this one's a tricky one. I'm not I'm not great at this one. Clearly, it happens. Oh, host eel. That's cool. It just it happens too quick. I can't handle it. It's scary. Eh. Maybe I'm just having another cash day. Let's see what else we got out here. Choo choo! Ah, we can make it. I can see the dock over there. It can be always dock overnight anyway, right? Oh no, because I no, because you need to be able to sell the fish. Choo choo! We can get there and back in time, I think. And hey, you know, if we need to do a little bit of nighttime fishing, I don't think it's a big deal. There it is. Numerous glowing shapes flicker and squirm beneath a distended ribcage. The west, the west of the wish. The rest of the fish is withered and drained. Just like my... We can end that sentiment right there. What are you? Are you just another mackerel? I don't know. We're getting pretty deep in the ocean here. Could be something cool beans. I think it's just a mackerel. You're not cool beans. You're not cool beans at all. Well, I do see lots of um, stuff over there, though. Material pack. Right. So this is the island where the builder wants materials delivered. So we need two pieces of lumber and two pieces of metal scrap. Okay. I don't want to. I don't want to rest here because I'll lose my um, my numerous eels. Okay. I think. I mean, having obviously having rest. Like obviously, I'd assume we'll be able to. 
I will finish the sentence eventually. <laughs> what did we just get? Engines provide 5% more movement speed. That's cool. Shoo, I am speed. Um, having docks further out, especially one that we could possibly sell at, would obviously be quite a big deal. For, like, for the reasons that we're seeing right now, right? So... Definitely, I think that might be the priority, actually. You grab some Mackies along the way. So it's not calling them Mackies. Mackies just means McDonald's. <laughs> I don't know if that's a universal thing or a British thing, but over here, Mackies means McDonald's. Now the Mackies for ages. I'm trying to be good. Despite myself. And to spite myself. <laughs> Nearly home. Not that I'm scared of the night now with my ball uh, new spotlights rolling around. I mean, it, maybe it's worth sometimes just going at night just because... Um, what should I get for this, by the way? Oh, 55. Oh, nice. Just because we get different fish, you know? Didn't they say the squid only come out at night, but I just got the squid. Hmm. Uh, right. Oh, she's so angry all the time. I do want. Uh, I don't know. What do I prioritize? You know what? Let's 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 go do a little nighttime fishing. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. A sneaky bit of nighttime fishing. Never hurt anyone, eh? This is mackerel. The main problem with time fishing, of course, is you can't see the fish. Although I do see something glowing over there. This little boy is going to lead the way. Need you protect me. Oh, that's my crabs. <laughs> How are we doing, crabs? Terribly. Absolutely terribly. In a way, you kind of want to get onto the open water because... Um, you're less likely to... Bump into something. There we go. Oh, the snag squid. Look at that. Terrifying beast. There we go. We got a lot of squid. Can we get a little bit more? A little bit more, maybe? A little something, something for me? I don't see anything. Let me check my other crab. Ah! Yeah, I think the, the increased yield one. Oh, oh, oh. Even with the lights improved so much, it's still traumatic. So a little scoot around. Let's grab what I can. Are these just mackerel? They look. Oh, squid. Yeah, you get tons of squid at night, I guess. Let's load up on squiddy witties. There we go. Now, no one's going to take my little whoa, monstrous squid away, so. Funny enough, if my boat was quicker, I'd probably be barging into things a lot more often. It's kind of a benefit that I'm not that fast. Tasting tongues writhe wildly around sets of yellowed, crooked teeth. The top row are flattened like human molars. It's not spooky at all. Oh, oh it's that. There's something in the water. Uh, what are you worth? 33. God, I'm so poor! Ah! I think I'm gonna get the Oceanic upgrade next. So I need, like, a, oh, we need some more catch, right? Let's, let's go... I don't want to go all the way down there. I think I want to do Blackstone Isle before I do this, because that's kind of like my stop along the way, right? I need materials, I need proper money. Let's, let's just go on a slightly longer adventure here, but I think I really want that oceanic lure, and we only need about 50 quid. Because whatever this is right here, this could be tuna or something. I can't get that right now. I don't have the right lure. Let's just go on a little, let's just go on a little, little adventure. I'm obviously apprehensive about going too far. Oh wait, I saw materials over here by Steel Point, actually. What are you? Yeah, we'll grab cod, cod are good. I like cod. 
if I say, uh, I eat quite a lot of fish. My dad's a pescatarian, and I'm the one who does all the cooking, so. <laughs> um, I cook pescatarian five days a week. Um, not always pes not always fish, sometimes just vegetarian rather than pescatarian, but it means I eat a lot of fish. Uh, not that much cod. A lot of bassa. Bassa's like a cheaper one, and we do like a recipe thing and it tends to be bassa so we, we eat a lot of bassa sometimes salmon bassa and salmon are definitely the big two. Oh, there's tons of materials here look at this there's like four of them that one's an actual full-on shipwreck all right very cool i might get everything we need right now wish i hadn't got the bloody fish <laughs> although i actually can fit everything in oh nearly what we'll do what we'll do is we'll be big brain We'll get the lumber, but we'll go turn it in now. Easy does it. Easy does it, Nelly. Good girl. Good girl. Nessie. I'm going to rename my ship. She's called Nessie now. So we need two of those. Good old Nessie. Choo choo. Nessie, because my daughter, who died off the coast of Iceland, loved the Loch Ness Monster. I'm also slightly aware I need to focus on this bit, bear with me. Goblet. That's cool. I'm also slightly aware that it's quite late already, and because time flies. And um, we do have fish that I want to sell. Now, let's go check this one out. I'm hoping for scraps. That looks good. That looks more. It looked more like scraps than it did like wood. So I was hoping this would be the way to go. Oh, I just need one more. I just need one more. Okay. Very cool. And we can get a bit more if we need to. But we should now, hopefully, be able to finish off. Oh no! My cod! My cod! God, I barely touched a bloody thing. You really can't hit a rock. <laughs> Hitting a rock is a, a death sentence. Yeah. Yeah. You delivered all the necessary materials. You should let the builder know. Oh. Okay, right. We, we have to get back to town then. Uh, I kind of want to do some fishing, but I really shouldn't. It's, it's 11 p.m. It's dark and spooky. What the hell? Whoa! <laughs> I don't like that. <laughs> Making ghost ships. Let's get out of here. What's going on? Oh, pursues. Okay, so we've done all of them except the relic one, which is is going to be a much more elongated mission. I think that's like my the mission that's going to take up the entire game, basically. Oh, 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 come on, Nessie. Come on, girl. Now there's a little rock to the left, if I remember correctly. Wait, does it, does it move? Am I crazy or do the rocks move? I swear that rock was on the left last time. Interesting. Lousy weather lately almost makes you not want to get out of bed, but you and I, we got to do it, eh? We're what keeps people from going hungry. Oh, they weren't worth much. However, they were worth enough. Let's go to the builder. You've done it. Well, no sense of wasting time. Let's get moving. Oh, all right. <laughs> I can't just stick her in the cargo hold. Oh, I only said it as a joke, and it literally is what happens. All right, I'll ferry you across in a minute. Let me let me do some stuff. Um, yeah. Oh, but then I can't afford the rod. Ah! No, screw it. We'll repair it next time. I want the rod. Oh, my paranoia did leave it in the morning. Now, it does mean, obviously, we've lost four slots, which isn't fantastic. But, oceanic capability is unlocked. Oh, we should go check on our crabs as well. <laughs> I'm just going to take this builder with me everywhere. Oh, this is awkward. Um, 
Okay, I need to move. <sighs> That's what I was trying to do. I was trying to move the goblet. Right, let's just leave the crabs. Oh, God. It's all getting a little bit higgledy-piggledy. What do we get? We got a bronze whaler, a beautifully, beautifully colored but deadly predator. Much like my mother. All right, let's get this goblet sold. <laughs> we'll have to try to sell her as well. <laughs> She's gotta be worth something. Uh, this is steel point, isn't it? Over that, yep. Yeah, yeah, okay. Let's get steel point and get her off. Wait, wait a minute. And then uh, on the way back, we can help a couple more oceanic fish points, get some of these really annoying <laughs> whalers, which are impossible to store. Oh, it's hard to resist. I don't, have I don't have room. Way back, way back. Get it on the way back. Get it on the way back. There is no room. There's no, I need a lot of materials. Choo choo! Nessie has arrived. You have arrived at your destination. Yes, yes, this'll do. Thank you, fella. Give me a short while to get things built here. You're welcome back anytime. She reaches into a toolbox and pulls out a handful of components. Take these. Good to have on hand. Oh, nice! Alright, alright, alright. Very cool. So, I don't know when that'll be done, but um, I guess we'll come back tomorrow and see if. Uh, She's updated at all. It's hard to know what to choose. Am I, do I want to focus on materials? Do I want to focus on money? I guess it doesn't really matter. We just kind of focus on both over time. What is this? Pearl earrings. All right. Um, I wouldn't mind. Can I fit a shark in? Yeah, I should be able to. I would like to grab one more. So let's go grab a shark, sell the earrings. Which is actually over this way. Sell the earrings, grab a shark, sell the sharks. Happy days. Sunday, Monday, happy days. Tuesday, Wednesday, happy days. Thursday, Friday, happy days. Saturday, happy days. Do 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 do. Don't know the rest of the song. Do 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 do. Oh, what we can also do. Oh, that... Mm. I saw that. That is an interesting idea. Huh. I'm gonna put... I'm gonna put my shark in storage. I really... I really need more room. This is nuts. Ah, oh, I lost a space. I didn't realize that's what happened. Because what I can do now is I can fish more on the way back, and my shark is still there in storage. So I can then sell the shark when I get there, you know? Big brain. Grab a bit of lumber. Loop, loop, loop. Oh, look at that. It's nighttime and scary again. Who'd have thunk it? I don't care. Let's go. Let's get some sharkies. I just saw some over here. Oh, wait, no, I didn't. Oh, I did, but they've disappeared. <laughs> they've turned into a different fish. What are you? Are you a grouper? I've got some groupers. Tusked grouper, okay. Cool. Always excited to see the aberrants. However, I can't fit anything else in. Let's have a little look at it. Have a little look. Pig-like tusks protrude from the mouth of this ravenous brute. No eyes to speak of it. Attacks indiscriminately. It's a spooky boy. I would rather have a shark, but that's fine. My concern is, though, that maybe pointing things to storage degrades them faster or something like that, but who knows. Ninety, Nice. Some fish prefer deeper, others stick to... It's important to know the depth you're working. Yeah. Alright, groupers are, groupers are pretty good. They do take up a lot of room, admittedly. My shark okay? 
stale. Stale. I mean, so it's not fresh. So it's worth a little bit less. It's all worth 66, though. All right, we got... That was good. We, we made some cash that time. Um... I can research now. I've got three parts. I say, again, I don't see the point in mangrove, coastal, volcanic, or any of that because we just don't need it at this point in time. Fifteen point eight, nine point five. So that gives nineteen. That gives sixteen for the same space. But that takes up both and gives 15, 30. Oh, I guess it is. Hmm, yeah, interesting. Hmm. This is barely an upgrade over what I've got already. Now that I look at it. That one, I don't see the point at all. That seems pointless to me. Um... Hmm. 36.8. What are we dealing with at the moment? 14.7, so it's 9 years. 29, 29.8, 30.5. Hmm. And that would be... We'd have to buy four of those, is the problem. But if we did, that would be... 18... What, 37? So that would... Uh, it's only a little bit more. Let's just get this. Alright, how much is this going to cost me? 450. If I sell both of these... I can't even sell that one. Sell that for 100, that's 359. 100 short. It's only, it's not a huge upgrade. I gain, what, six knot, knots? Five knots? Something like that. So it's it's probably worth doing, but it's not a big deal. Choo choo! We're going out again! A rebel with, oh, I should fix my ship, actually. Gain that slot back. Choo choo! I'm gonna go check my crab pots. Come on, Nessie. There's something glowing over there. It's always exciting. Ooh, okay. Potentially quite exciting. Get like an. Oh, black reef shark. Oh, that's cool. Oh, God, you're so awkward. Cleft mouth shark. Amazing. Does it, can I really not fit two of these in together? There's got to be a way, right? Uh, <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> there had to be. There had to be a way. What have you got for me? Getting a little okay, okay. I think it might be time to head home. I want to get. Oh, where's my other? Where's my other crab though? Right, it's directly ahead of me. Go, 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 go. Get me the hell out of here. I think my paranoia is okay. It's still white, so the the eye goes red eventually, which signifies spookiness. I think. See, that rock isn't there anymore. Oh, oh, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> Let's not do that. Okay, got ourselves a new fishy wishy. Two new fishy wishies. A cleft mouth shark. A large body dice bisected by an enormous grinning maw. Teeth stretch down forever into the blackness of its large gullet. And that's my uh, black tip reef shark. Usually placid during the day, these predators enter a frenzied hunt when the sun sets. So this is probably my daytime one. That's my nighttime one. Yeah, for the same location. Seemingly. Alright, what are you going to give me for these? Well, the crabs are worth... Well, they're fresh still. God, they're not worth much. Five. Ten. 
like 15 I got from that crab hole. It's going to cost me plenty to fix it. 277 for that, though. Oh, amazing. And one, yeah, those black tip, tip reef sharks are definitely. I mean, they're impossible to fit, but they are cool. I, I, I'm not making any money from these crab pots. Unironically. I, I literally made like 50 cents or something that time. Um, oh, but we can get the engine upgrade. Go. Um, do I just have to keep that? Because it's my default, I suppose. All right. Choo choo. Once more unto the breach. Right, I'm gonna put the crabs in. We're gonna just do it here. I don't feel like I got anything more out there in the the ocean, so what's the point? Uh, right, we need materials more than anything else, don't we? So let's just try to focus. I've got cash <laughs> for the first time. I've got a little bit of money on me, so let's just focus on mats. We need wood, we need metal, we need everything. Shapes in the deep. Staring through the maggot drawer. What is that on the left? What are you? Oh, oh no. Oh, Nelly. It's, it's, it's just a raise, isn't it? It's just a very slow moving one. Um, oh, let's go check on Steel Point. That's a good thing we can we can do as we head out. It's a flounder. Stare into the maggot draw. I'm hoping there'll be someone out here who buys fish. I wonder what madness awaits me out there in the open waters. If I had to guess, I think next video we'll. I just want to see what this is. Could it just be a, a shark? I think it's just a shark. Yeah. Uh, I hate them so much. <laughs> but if I had to guess, I don't think we're far off being able to properly head out there into the waters as well. Right, we might go for the Gale Cliffs pretty soon. Oh, hello. What's going on here? A one strong wooden hull lays broken against the shoreline. The stern is completely breached. Let's climb inside it. You pull a bit closer and manage to clamber. Whoa, whoa, Nelly. Okay, sorry. Sorry, buddy. You're, you're gone. <laughs> Research parts. Pearl earrings. Bit of cloth. Very cool. Very, very cool. The fact is, now that I don't... Oh, wait. What am I doing? Not sure what the point of this is yet. Other than being cool. <laughs> That's like literally the best thing I can think about. It's cool. She's got a little house. Builder. Hey, thanks again for helping me move out here. I've managed to get myself set up now. I found this while unpacking. You should take it. A new book. She hands you a book. The cover is dusty, but in good condition. If you ever need to use the dock or store stuff here, be my guest. Oh, so I didn't really get access to much, actually. Um... Oh, I'm gonna research next. Well, I don't. Mm, ah, er, ah. There we go. Clear up. Lovely, 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 lovely. This is priority right now. We don't need to faff around with that too much because we've got plenty of space. Choo choo! Some interesting islands. Oh no, it's the middle of the, it's nearly spooky night time. Let's not let's not stop faffing around. I F that up, didn't I? with me. 
Bear, bear with me. <laughs> I don't think these are... Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay. Let's very cautiously make our way back home. Some rocky fears going on, to say the least. Whatever lurks in the depths and the darkness. In the muck and the mire. Oh, eels. God damn it. God damn it. The eel one messes me up way more than any other. Oh, I don't trust those other boats. They're ghost boats. They're ghosts. I mean, they're worth a decent amount. Uh, right. So we've got money. Money is fine right now. By my standards, anyway, right? I don't. We've got five hundred nine quid. Uh, I don't think there's anything I want to actively buy. What have we got? What have we got? What have we got? Wait, I need metal and wood. Don't I have both of those? Let's just get it all out. Here we go. Lovely job, late. Okay. Lovely. Last one. So we need... You know what? It's funny. This seemed like really hard work a minute ago. And now it's like way ahead of where I thought we were going to be. So yeah, we can now put... I can't remember what that is, but we can put something there. Oh, it's just an extra rod, isn't it? Yeah, it's a little baby rod. Uh, oh, this is the rod one. Is it the nets? Must be the nets. Got a little engine. Oh, that's why we want to research the little engine. Because we could have a little baby engine there. There and there. Right. Okay. Good to know. Hmm. All right. Uh, ship right. Okay. So, basic trawl net. The simple design passively catches basic fish. Interesting. The problem is you have to uninstall and restall. So, like, I can't just like, buy it and sort of have it sat in my inventory. I have to buy it and install it over the hydraulic rod, which I then have to sell for half price. I, I like the idea. It's just, do I want to throw away $205 to do it? Right, we'll end it there. Thanks for joining me. Cheers, Mr. As always, bye bye.